I was first diagnosed when I was 13. It was after just leaving a prestigious dance school. I was reassured that it wasn't my technique and that it was my physique. I spiralled downwards. I got taken out of school, didn't really have any friends. I was completely isolated. It's kind of hard to describe what it did to me mentally. I felt like I wasn't really in the real world. And obviously the physical side effects were endless. Every time you got to a goal, the goal would get lower. The goals never stopped, and I don't think they would have until I'd have died. In a negative sense, you have to be incredibly strong and determined to be anorexic. They say that there's no wrath like an anorexic's. I was incredibly violent, aggressive. I would punch, hit, scream. I would do anything just to avoid my family forcing me to eat. I hated everything about myself. I would wake up for the scales. In a funny sense, they kept me alive because it was sometimes the only reason I'd get out of bed or the only reason I would not kill myself. Dance for me is therapy. It's my place to go and release everything that I'm feeling. I've learnt my own strength. I've learnt how resilient I can be. What only matters is what we give value to. And I gave my value to numbers and appearances, and that's not what's important. Time is completely emotion-led. When you're having a great time, time flies. And when you're having a horrible time, it drags. I would wake up every morning wishing it to be night already. Every minute was so slow and painful. But now I don't know where the time goes. I think that's because I'm happy completely unaware of the clock.